Hello, my name is Julio Salazar. I bring you uh, greetings from Antigua, Guatemala. I'm the country director for uh, Niños de Guatemala. This is a short video to, just to give you an update of the conditions, the situation here in Guatemala for all our friends uh, and uh, people that have been uh, wondering what's going on. We are comparatively doing quite well as a country. We're a country of about 17 million people. Uh, as of yesterday, we have 42 confirmed cases of coronavirus, out of which 12 have been uh, recovered completely and one death. Uh, we are uh, doing much better than many other countries. The schools are all closed um, by decree by, by the government and um, they will continue to be closed until the end of April, at least. So what are we doing? So our, our uh, focus at this moment is to take care of our families, of the children that we take care of at the schools and their families. Uh, to that end, we, I am getting uh, reports every week from the principals who are working with the uh, social workers and psychologists and some of the teachers to get information about the families and how they're doing. Uh, what we have uh, up until now is that about 25% of the approximately 350 families out there um, are in pretty dire condition. They either lost their job, they, they have no income, or uh, they barely have enough. Uh, those are the families where we're concentrating our efforts in, in helping. Uh, help is coming uh, from two angles. We, uh, we do a small part by helping with uh, some of the money that we have in the budget for snacks and things like that. We're buying some supplies and some food to help and the government is also um, bringing food to the communities uh, every now and then. We're also trying to keep the children engaged in educational activities. We utilize the telephone, we utilize uh, uh, the internet and television through programs that the government is facilitating. We want to extend our deep gratitude and appreciation for the continued support uh, of all of our friends and we want to encourage uh, a little more. We can do so much more, especially with those families that are uh, suffering from, uh, from this crisis. We, we are committed to continuing to, to, to work with these families and with our communities. We know that we can come out of this uh, a better country, a better people. Thank you very much for your support.